I was having trouble finding something really good today to make a video from. So I went to the community forum and I found this posting. I'm going to hide their name from you. But this person says, everything I submit always gets rejected. Some of them, I understand the reasoning, but some are so wrongfully rejected. It's so stupid. Two trail signs rejected as well as many others. Anyone else encounter these problems? The reason I'm picking this is, by the way, charge your phone, please. The, way I, the reason I'm picking this is I'm going to go through all of these and tell you what I think of them. The first one here is this river nomination. And new submitters tend to make this mistake. They think like, oh, a park qualifies. So all I have to do is take a picture of a park. A trail qualifies. So all I have to do is take a picture of a trail. That's not the case. It's not necessarily the trails in those cases that are qualifying. It's the signs announcing them. So in this case, they've taken a picture of, I don't know, they say a river. It doesn't look much like a river to me, but uh, I don't know. Maybe it's a river in Florida. But to the average reviewer, they would want to see a sign. To them, looking at this, this is just a natural feature and they're declining it. Always try to find a sign if possible. This one, it's a tractor lot, but you can't even see it. And would a tractor lot be a great place to socialize? Would it be a great place to exercise? Um, I, don't, I don't really think so. <laughs> this, this does not qualify unless, of course, you know, on this tractor lot, they had some sort of sculpture or maybe a mural or something like that, something else that qualifies, then you could submit that. But just a tractor lot is not going to qualify. This one, they're talking about a rest area. And I don't know, rest area is one of those things that I just don't know why Niantic put that in the list. It's just, it's very misleading. And again, you can barely even see what's being nominated. I can't even see if there are benches there. I think maybe there's a bench. But Niantic stated in the past that for a bench, they would like to have something special about it or they would like to have it under sort of a shade structure because if somebody's playing, they want them to be able to stand in the shade. Now, not all reviewers go to that kind of standard, but you're not going to just approve a bench that has nothing special about it. I mean, imagine if you approved every single bench that there was out there. I mean, maybe it would be great for Pokemon Go, but I think we'd have a lot of Ingress players complaining. So um, it says in voting upgraded next. I'm pretty sure it's denied. Kids holding heart fountain. Now, it says not accepted, but we really don't know much about this. I mean, it looks like it's accepted. But perhaps it's in a front yard, which would make it not acceptable. Just by looking at the picture they've provided here, we, we just don't know enough. But considering people said not accepted, I would guess it's either at a private residential home or it's something that reviewers are considering that's on private property, which sometimes I don't really understand that reasoning. Like when I try to nominate things at hotels and they get rejected, and people say, well, it's private property. I don't get that either. But we don't have enough for that. <clears throat> All right, the vineyard sign. I already did a video about this. Just unordinary entry signs into communities do not qualify. You have to have something special about it. Like uh, I did one where the entry was actually almost like a gazebo. It, it, you know, it had this structure and there was seating. And I said that would qualify. And some entries, at least where I live, they have fountains. A fountain would qualify. Maybe there's something very artistic about the sign. That may qualify. But this is just a sign announcing a neighborhood called the Vineyards. does not qualify. This one says National Park Rest Stop. Uh, it kind of looks like the one that they submitted before. I don't know if it's the same one. But again, it's just some generic benches on a sidewalk. Doesn't qualify. Here they are. They, they really like nominating benches for the same reason. Just 
plain ordinary benches are not going to qualify. This one's Alger Farms lot East Field. I have really no clue what this is supposed to be. I can't really tell from this, but it doesn't look like it qualifies to me. There's no sign, so it's just a picture of something, and we don't even know what it is. Not accepted. This one, we're back to an entrance sign, Sonoma entrance sign number two. Again, this is just a very generic sign into a community. It does not qualify. They tried the vineyards sign again. Same thing. There's nothing artistic about it. It doesn't qualify. They really want to get these signs in the game. Again, nothing artistic, nothing special. There's no fountain. There's nothing in here that would qualify. This one, it's a National Park Hiking Biking Trail sign. And again, we don't really have a lot to go on, but it's taped onto something. Taped onto a wall. It's not permanent. People are not going to accept that. Here we are, rest area again. They really like benches. Nope, doesn't qualify. Now this one is a trail sign, but it says brand new trail will connect Biscayne and Everglades National Parks, inaugural ride, Saturday, looks like March 15th. This is an advertisement. An advertisement is going to go away as soon as the trail opens. No, it does not qualify. They wasted their appeal. Picture of original racetrack. Huh. It's, it's really hard to tell about this one. We don't have a lot to go on. It says in voting. I don't know whatever happened to it. But me, personally, if it's just something hung on the wall, I'm not going to approve it. If it looks like it's something really large and permanently affixed to the, to the wall, like sometimes businesses will have murals, but... They're like decorated with edging and they make them look like some photograph is hanging on the wall, but you can tell that it's like permanently there. And this doesn't look like that, but we really don't have enough information. We'd have to see the whole thing, but <clears throat> it'd be interesting. It would be interesting to see if that got through. And then they tried this vineyards sign again. Again, nothing artistic about it, just a straight sign. There they are, they tried that trailhead sign again that's taped to something, no. There's that rest spot again with just the benches, no. Here's that same temporary advertising sign, no. And then we're back to this. We don't have an answer on that one. So that is it. I hope that helped you, especially if you're a new submitter, to see what kind of things may not qualify before you submit them. And if I find anything else like this where a lot of examples are given, then I'll go ahead and make a video.